Hello and welcome to today's practice. In today's yoga class, we will work more than usual in our breath work to make our lungs stronger and to connect to our bodies even more. So let's start in the easy cross-legged and with a breath in, let your arms slide up and with a breath out, let them glide down to your heart center. With a gentle bow, set your intention for today's practice. Interlace your fingers and with a breath in, let your arms go up with a breath out, down. Breathe in and breathe out. Seated cat cow with our arms raised, bringing agility to our spine and we're going from side to side to the right and to the left, letting the breath flow Breathe out when you go forward, breathe in to the side. Warming up our spine, warming up our lungs, creating more space and making each breath a little bit deeper than the one before. Breathe out, open your arms, breathe in all the way up and going for a side bend feel free to stay here or with a breath in open your arm breath out go down touch the elbow to the ground in and out let the movement flow through your body like the breath is going through your body in and out bringing more volume to the right side that we're bending creating more space in our lungs bringing left arm around gentle twist breathe out go a little bit further breathe in coming back to the center breathe out and in out and in breathe in arms up breathe out bend to the left feel free to stay there or go a little higher up and down breathe in up breathe out flow down finding more space more movement between our ribs long spine pulling the navel in and bringing the right arm around and as you breath out find a nice twist breathe and come back and just allowing our spine to twist bring your attention where exactly you're twisting if you can twist a little lower in your spine mid back lower back bringing more agility to our spine breathe in arms up breathe out your heart center breathe out and in we're going for twists switch the sides one breath out open breathe in out in and out breathe out A little quicker breath work here. Pulling the navel in as you breathe. Gentle roll in your shoulders and we're gonna bring the shoulder blades up and down. Breathe in and breathe out. Let your shoulders drop down. Keep going with your rhythm, feel free to slow down if you need to or speed up if that feels too slow. 
I like to do this exercise with my eyes closed, bringing, bringing your focus into the center between your eyebrows. Now for a nice glute stretch with leg bend, just flex and point, finding nice deeper stretch in preparation for a nice cradle pose with bent or straight leg. So feel free to hug your leg or stay where you were. Flexing the left leg, stretching the knee if you can, checking if the spine is straight and we're gonna grab our right toe and open to the side. Half upright seated angle pose. And as you breathe out, bring the leg forward, breathe in, side. Breathe out and in. Let the movement travel with your breath. Slow down if you need to. And let the leg down, switching to the sides. Flex and stretch the foot, bringing the left knee further out and feel free to stay there or going further, hug your left leg, move from side to side, release the tension in your shoulder blades and your neck, long spine, flex your right foot, stretch the leg. Just find your inner peace. And connect to your left toe, open to the side, bringing the right heel forward. And as you breathe out and breathe in, let your leg move forward and side. You can just keep your leg to the side and listen to your breath. Breathe out, breathe in, breathe out and in. Release the left leg and lift the hips up. Keep breathing. Pull the navel in, pull the mula bandha in our pelvic floor and bring your pelvis up to the bridge and bring it down without touching the floor. Breathe in, breathe out, hover over the floor. Breathe in, pelvis up, breathe out, down. Bring the attention to the space between your knees as if you're squeezing an invisible object to activate our inner thighs. Keep pulling the navel in and come back down. Go through your knees for a happy puppy pose. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe out, breathe in. Breathe out, curve the spine. Breathe in, arch. Cat cow in a happy puppy pose. Feel free to use the blocks to create a little bit more space and allow a bigger range in our spine and in our shoulders. So breathe out, curve the spine, breathe in, bring the chest closer to the ground. Again, connect to your own speed. Listen what your body needs today and go with it. And go with your breath flowing in and out. Out and in. And put your props aside if you were using any, bringing the right leg forward 90 degrees. 
connecting to our gate pose and we're going sliding to low lunge and in preparation for the camel pose nice arch here and sliding forward breathe out and breathe in breathe out forward breathe in breathe out nice arch chest open maybe all the way feel free to change the variation as your body feels like go all the way down or just up vertically gentle bend on all the way here we're bringing attention to keep our left hip forward and shifting to the side connecting to the half circle pose and the gate pose alternation side bends again here listen to your breath breathe out when you bend breathe in when you bend to the other side breathe out and breathe in opening the ribs here make sure you pull your navel in feel the distance between your inner thighs keeping those legs active flex the right toes to challenge your balance a little bit and keep going with a breath switching to the other side left leg forward 90 degrees and we're going for a nice lunge forward breathe in breathe out breathe in as you arch breathe out come up breathe in breathe out breathe in as you go all the way to the big arch and breathe out as you come up go with the flow of the movement with the flow of the breath opening the chest opening our ribs expanding the space in our lungs as if we're learning how to breathe again bringing more awareness to our breath being grateful for our ability to breathe deeper switching to the side going for side bends to the left and to the right breathe in and breathe out feel free to move quicker or move slower and breathe slower and if you need to add two breaths and the one go feel free to do so breathe out and breathe in let your ribs open and come back to your knees tuck your toes down facing dog long spine bend your knees gently and send a generous wave to your arms arch and breathe out down facing dog breathe in arch breathe out down facing dog open the chest long spine open the chest more especially when we arch make sure you're pulling your navel in and let this pull bring you back to our down facing dog with the breath going generous breath flowing through our body in 
and out. And going to our knees, shifting our weight, and going for a gentle butterfly stretch, opening our spine a little bit. Use the block or roll or pillow to place right in your mid back and place another block under your head if you need to. Or if you want to be without the block or make it a little bit flatter, that's also an option. A beautiful heart opener. Let go of the tension. Release what no longer serves you. And let the breath come in and out of your body naturally. Listen to how your ribs expand from the back, from the sides, up and down. And I like to bring my arms above my head to increase the stretch in our shoulder blades. Enjoy the quiet of your mind. By simply bringing our attention to our breath in our fingertips in our toe tips, just letting the breath fill up our whole body. Releasing the tension from our face. Releasing the tension from our legs and belly. And gently roll through the side or feel free to stay where you are a little bit longer. Going to our easy cross-legged. Long spine. Breathe in, arms up. Breathe out, let them slide down to your heart center. Thank you for sharing with me your practice. Namaste.